Hello and welcome to your Adobe Connect tutorial presented by Meeting One University. This section is about the Q&A pod. The Q&A pod is used to answer participant questions throughout or at the end of the session. Adding a Q&A pod, select pods followed by Q&A. There are two views within the Q&A pod. The first view is the presenter view. The second view is the participant view to show what it will look like to participants. When a participant asks a question when you're in the presenter view, you can choose to show all questions, show open questions, answered, or my questions, as questions can be assigned to any host or presenter. When you choose to answer the question, you can choose to send the answer privately to just the participant who asked the question or to the entire group so everyone can see the question and answer. For participants asking a question, all they need to do is type in their question and hit the send question button. When a new question comes in, presenter or host can choose to assign it to another presenter or host within the room. When you choose to answer a question and send the answer privately to the participant, it will show the participant that their question was answered privately. When you choose to answer a question and send the answer to everyone, All the participants will see the question and then your answer. From the pod options menu, you can change the view, export the Q&A log, you can save it as an RTF or rich text file, or email the Q&A to yourself. You can clear all the questions. You can move the presenter view to the presenter only area. You can send a message from within the Q&A pod to a participant, can select preferences, you can show or hide the names of the submitter. To remove a single question, select the question followed by the delete option. To clear the entire list, select the pods drop down followed by clear all questions. And that concludes our Q&A pod session. For more information, please visit us at meetingone.com support.